The breaking news, a pickup truck barrels into a home in Nassau County overnight, leaving a path of destruction. Well, despite all the damage, police say no one was injured. CBS 2's Elijah Westbrook joins us live from the scene in Westbury, where investigators are trying to determine what happened. Elijah? Well, Chris and Alice talk about a close call. As you mentioned, no one was hurt in this crash here. But take a look behind me. You can see the uh, path of destruction this crash has created this morning. Nassau County Police tell us a pickup truck slammed right into this Long Island home just after 1 o'clock this morning. You can see the tire marks in the grass again leading up to the home and into this person's backyard. Now, I just spoke with the homeowner not too long ago who is visibly shaken up by all of this. He said the truck crashed into his son's bedroom where he was sleeping. He said he didn't know what happened at first, but his gut reaction was to run downstairs and grab his son to safety. Now, in the process, he tells me he eventually realized that a truck had plowed through the home and saw the driver of the vehicle get out and casually walk away. The homeowner also tells me the driver, who he's describing as a young Hispanic male, told him repeatedly, I didn't do it, again, before he walked off. Now, last check from Nassau County Police, they're still looking for the driver who fled the scene, although the homeowner says he's now hearing that police arrested the guy down the road. So, of course, we're working on confirming that information. But in the meantime, police are here at the scene investigating this wild incident. Uh, we also see some code enforcement personnel checking the home for additional damage. They tell us that the home right now is unlivable. So, again, luckily, no one was hurt in this crash. When, of course, when things calm down a bit, we'll try getting another interview with the homeowner. But absolutely incredible, Chris and Alice, what we're seeing out this way. For now, we're live in Westbury, Long Island. Elijah Westbrook, CBS 2 News. All right, Elijah, thank you.